anymore. Uh, we've been up for a little while and now we're gonna go to the supermarket because I have no breakfast. I'm out of food. And then when I come home, I'm gonna do something about this mess of hair. Here I am. Will you comb my hair? What are we gonna do? We're gonna get breakfast. Lidl. I'm super hungry. Me too. Super hungry. I could eat a whole Leslie Ann. No, I could eat a vegan horse. I have my strong man to carry my groceries for me. Carrying her melons. But they were all on sale. Your in's like, they're not any lighter because they were on sale. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> and we got stickers. Jorian, what did we buy at the supermarket? Juice. Orange juice? And hummus, and bread. Bread? And almond milk, and stickers. No, we didn't buy these. We get them when you spend money. And bread, and a pretzel for you. And melons. We got a big watermelon, some ginger for ginger tea. And all melons were on sale. These were all one euro. And this big melon was just two euros. <laughs> and I'm so hungry. I don't know about you. I'm already having breakfast. And let's see what stickers we got. Look, it's Yerian. Where? Sticker unboxing. Yerian is not so impressed. I'm already impressed. I'm very excited. Ooh. We have half a hazelnut. No, half an acorn. Much impressed. <laughs> the feet and crotch of an unknown animal. I think it's a beaver. And a lion. Only 140 left to go. So how much do we have to spend at the Lidl? You get four with every 10 euros. So that is... We have to spend 350 euros at... Legal. If we want 140 of these. So you better buy me a lot of melons because I want all the stickers here in. We have been chilling out like nothing else. It is half past four. You're in coat my hair, it's all back to soft. You're in left. He's gonna pick up a rental bike and then we're gonna meet together at a coffee place he wanted to check out. Yeah. Oh yes. Six. Oh, it's six o'clock now. <laughs> Yuri finally has his coffee and I have my favorite mate drink. My favorite brand, I guess. And it's quite hard to find. Yuri just found the biggest pretzel. Oh my God. Holy crap. That is the biggest pretzel. It's like we're at Oktoberfest. My German friend told me recently that pretzels aren't German, they're Bavarian. It's bigger than your head. We're now at Weizensee, which is a lake in the city. We're gonna eat lunch. We have a big bread. And at what time are we having lunch? <laughs> like seven. And with that we have stuff I bought the vegans. This is smoked salmon slices. Vegan, of course. And vegan cheddar cheese. I wanted to try this, but I thought it was quite expensive, but now it was on sale. And now it's, I guess, still expensive, but... You gotta, oh, it looks so gross. I was gonna say, you gotta treat yourself. This looks gross. We're gonna go urbexing, and I saved this one especially for when Urian was here because this building is apparently supposed to be really dangerous because it is just so rotten and on fire. Yeah, and like in 2013, I think it was on fire 17 times. Yep. And two weeks ago, somebody was seriously hurt whilst airboxing here. So I saved this one for with Yuri and I wouldn't want to do this on my own. I'll save her if she gets hurt. He's going to save me. We're already seen where we're going to go in and it's going to be pretty easy. The gate is locked. Now what? We should climb over it. It's an old children's hospital, by the way. I don't think there's much left of the hospital, but it's supposed to be really cool for graffiti. Couldn't be easier. I'm so excited. Okay, it's already pretty spooky. Boom. Now, Yerian, don't do that. You can really see this was on fire a couple of times. We forgot our torch and it's already pretty dark and it's also in the woods, making it even darker. You can't go urbexing without finding a lot of graffiti penises. Phone torch. This one said Kinder Krankenhaus, which means children's hospital. So there are several buildings. Some look better than others. This one looks pretty good, but then this one. 
Here I am. I want to climb that. <laughs> you will know. Yurian says no. If I was alone, I would be a bit scared, but Yurian's here. That makes me feel so safe. Oh, we could go into the cellar. We're not gonna go into the cellar, okay? Nope. That's too scary. This graffiti is kind of scary. Yeah, as you can see, the ceiling is coming down. I think I'm not up for going to the first floor of this building. What was this? This looks like somebody set a couch on fire. The perfect place for vandals. The vandals even spray painted the trees. They're going too far. This is the roof. We're on the ground floor. This was once the roof. The roof is on fire. Wow, this place is indeed dangerous. What did you say? <laughs> the roof, the roof, the, the roof, roof is, is on, on fire. fire. The roof is also coming down here, as you can see. I feel safest standing in the doorways because I do feel like the roof could <laughs> collapse at any moment. Oh. sick of urbexing just sit down in this comfortable couch right here I was searching for these graffiti so we're gonna go inside this building we're now in a third building and we went in through the cellars and climbed our way up here. I was so scared I didn't even want to grab the camera. But look at the graffiti. Oh, how I love this. Sorry, it's so dark. You can barely see it, but how awesome is this? We have the Christmas tree room and then the daisy room. And here we have the carrot room. Here is capture the zombie. That's me. <laughs> awesome guys, look at the room full of hearts. Guys, this is the cupcake room. How adorable, I love it. This is the cheese room. Yeah, it's totally cheese. There's a mouse here. Don't forget to eat vegan cheese. I think my favorite room is this one with all the hearts on the walls. Yay, love for all genders. Look, and this is a very happy heart. Oh, scary stuff. We're gonna leave the attic because it's not very safe and there's also not a lot to see. I'm very dark. Karen just asked if I needed a toilet. <laughs> one little heart is a penis. <laughs> Oh, we've seen the hard way to get out. Let's see what the other way is. We're just going like that to the right. Damn, that seems easier. Mr. Know it all. You can basically just walk in through the front door that's right on the street. <laughs> Woo we came across nobody else. It was just us. What are we gonna do? I'm gonna eat them both. You're gonna eat them both? No, no. Hey, here with my pizza. I have vegan pizza Hawaii with pineapple. What do you have? Vegan calzone with everything. There's like mushrooms and peppers and. Cut it open and show us. Mm. On a piece of mine? This is the pizza place, by the way. Their pizzas are awesome, and a lot of them are vegan. Here and I just got home. It is oh, it's already twelve o'clock. Yep. Should we try and go to bed before one? We shouldn't make it too late. Let's I'm working on my rhythm. Well, no. Thanks for watching. No. <laughs> Hope to see you in the morning. No. <laughs> no. Thanks a bunch for watching. I'm not done with the vlog yet. We're going to bed. No, we're not yet. Yes, I am. Goodbye. Okay, you're just gonna sleep. Who's cute? Who is cute? Who is cute? 
You're in only sleeps with a bottle of water, some chocolate and my comb. My best friend. I thought I was your best friend. You're my second best friend. Oh. I need water to survive. I can probably survive without you. Although it will be very, very, very hard. I could survive without you too, but I just don't wanna. When I came in, there was something on my door. You guys should see it. Look at this drawing. It's me with a little kitty cat. The cat is so adorable. I freaking love this so much. Oh, that sounds a little bit weird. Not easy to please you. Oh, it is. You know exactly how to do that. Yeah, by giving you beer. No, I'm not drinking this month. You're not drinking this month? Tell me if you were all about it. Well, I, I am drinking, otherwise I'd obviously be dead. But I'm not drinking anything with alcohol. We're going to have to do it without me drinking beers in the vlogs. I guess I felt like it. So instead there will be lots of shots with me drinking Caffeine. club mate, water, or other sophisticated drinks. Like ginger ale. Ginger ale from Berlin. And have you guys seen your insured already? Yes, they did, because I've worn it already a couple of times. Yeah, but we haven't really pointed out the little cute ki kitties on it, have we? Jaren found me this drink. It's Mio Mate Banana. It's a banana drink. And it's not a juice, it's a soda. I think it's gonna be horrible. Banana. I think I might regret this decision. What is this? It's Mio Mio Mate Banana. Yeah, but what the... It's not bad, but it's strange. I give it 5 out of 10. Guys, we made it. It is. For one. This is Jurgen's hand. Uh, He's also saying bye. Nee, nee, nee. Jurgen. Hello. We're going to sleep. Sleep. Say goodbye. Bye. He's no longer decently dressed, so you're not going to say goodbye, are you? Goodbye. <laughs> I'm gonna say bye as well. Guys, thanks for watching. She means to say thanks a bunch for watching. Thanks a bunch for watching. Hope, Hope to, to see, see you guys tomorrow. tomorrow. <laughs> bye guys. Bye. <laughs> bye. <laughs>